Um, good morning, it's currently half six on a Monday and it's my first week of third year. So I thought I'd vlog that um, for the week. Today I've got two seminars back to back that are both two hours of hunger and the first one is at 9am, hence the early start that's feeling a bit brutal right now but I think it'll feel better later in the week when I've got more gaps um, because of having to you know, cram it all in on a Monday. But yeah, today's Neanderthals, and then I'll do my Spanish elective, which I'm really excited for. I've not had a coffee yet, so that's priority number one. Then I need to get ready and go to uni. Mm. So I just got home and the weather has been shocking today so I've not filmed very much and I've just been so focused on trying to get between one class to the other because there's no gap so a bit of a trek but it was alright, I made it there. Um, my first lecture was two hours on Neanderthals so that's my assess seminar which is really uh, later on we're going to teach chair a seminar based on the topic of Neanderthals but today was just sort of an introductory lecture on to the Neanderthals just you know we took all the information together and that was that was really fun, I really enjoyed that. Then I had my Spanish electives, I'm doing an elective in Spanish this year, um, just beginners and that was that was a lot of fun, I really enjoyed that. I really missed learning a language, I did German up until A level and yeah I really missed learning a language and yeah Spanish, Spanish seems right, I'm hoping I can do, do well in that and hopefully learn a new language. Uh, but right now I'm gonna make some lunch, I've got some leftover tomato soup from last night and I'm going to make a cheese toastie to dip in it because I'm pretty hungry. Um, has, there is some work I want to do this afternoon. I've got a researcher's eye for dissertation due in a few weeks. I might do some arm, but I am I'm quite tired, so I think I might just relax. But yeah, first day back is always, always tiring. But yeah, it's been a good day so far. I'm going to make a toastie. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I just got back from the gym, um, which was good. I'm really glad I went actually. Um, I'm a bit more tired though now. And yeah, I'm not quite hungry enough for tea yet, so I'm gonna finally crack on and do a bit of admin bits that I had to do. Uh, mostly just trying to get some more of my research design in a better situation. And that's what died earlier, so I just want to make some notes from Spanish. I've got Spanish again tomorrow morning at 9 a.m. I uh, so just want to look over what tomorrow is going to be about, just to, you know, make sure everything's going pretty well. Um, also tomorrow I have a meeting with my supervisor, uh, which is usually pretty chill, but just, you know, something else for, to do tomorrow. And yeah, I think, I think I'm going to make a burrito for tea. Not a, not a good burrito, just like a, I don't know, basically just a wrap. Um, I really fancy salsa with it, but I don't. I don't think I've got any salsa or the ingredients to make salsa, so probably make like some sort of bastardized salsa recipe, um, which should be yummy. And um, that's kind of probably about it for today. Uh, probably just watch some more TV, maybe play some video games later. So I spent way longer doing that than I thought I would. would. Um, I was literally just editing references um, for my bibliography section of this. 
I've just been doing them by hand because I felt like my um, citation software has just not been working in the right format lately. So that's what I'm doing behind. It's just, just taking forever a bit out of practice, I think, because it's been a while since I've wrote anything. Um, but it's getting there. I've only got two more to format. But I'm getting hungry now, so I'm going to throw in some food in the oven, start making my wraps, and then get a shower while it's all cooking. And then, yeah, eat some tea. Uh, watch another episode of Agatha All Along. I watched the first one earlier and I really enjoyed it. And that'll probably be it for the night. And I guess I'll see you in the morning. It is now Tuesday and um, today's morning is probably going to be pretty much the exact same as yesterday morning. I've uh, got another 9am on campus, um, so it's now like, it's a bit later than yesterday, it's like 7 eight, before 7. As, it really didn't take me long to get to use it for, which is nice. Uh, so just making a coffee. quite cold today. I can feel it getting to that autumnal sort of weather. But yeah, today is just I'm only in campus for my alarm's going off. I'm only in camp on campus for an hour for my Spanish. Um so that'll be really chill I think. Yeah, I'm excited for Spanish again. I really enjoyed it yesterday. And then later in the afternoon I have a meeting with my academic supervisor, which is Always be fun. So I'll just probably come home in between though because that one's in town. And yeah, and tonight's Bake Off is the first episode of the new series. Um, so I'm definitely going to have to watch that, but that's not till 8. So probably do some uni work in between that time. And I think that's probably going to be about it today. Not not very really eventful. i uh, probably should look over all my notes from yesterday and today just to make sure i got everything oh, I'm making a mess. just to make sure i've got everything down but i think it's gonna be a pretty pretty show day um so i having two 9am's back to back monday and tuesday did not seem like the best on paper but i think i'm an early bird so it you know Kind of frees up the rest of the week now I've got most of uni out of the way. I only have one more thing on Thursday, which is just a two hour dissertation module. You won't be able to hear me over that. Okay, pretty chill. I just said what I want to do tomorrow, because I'm not in actual uni tomorrow, but we should do some work. Uh, probably dissertation stuff. Try and get on top of it all. That's a coffee. A good start to the day. Um, yeah, have some breakfast, get dressed, get ready. Then it'll be time to head to uni. Let's go. So I've just got back from Spanish. Um, it was really good again. It was only an hour and it went so quickly. I'm a bit peckish now, so I think I might make another smoothie. And yeah, I've made a list of um, jobs, like just some random miscellaneous stuff that I kind of need to do. Um, so I'm just going to open that up on my laptop and just see how much I can get done before 2 o'clock. Have some lunch at some point before then as well. Then I've got my supervisor meeting at King's Manor, so it's about a like, 20 minute walk away. And so yeah, I'll leave it for that. And yeah, I think I need to get a notebook for Spanish. I'm just using like sheets of paper at the moment. Uh, but I think an actual notebook just to put vocabulary in. So I've got my own sort of vocab book all together uh, with some grammar rules just all in one place and neatly um, written up would be quite helpful. So I think I might try and get one of those today if I can't find one that in town or it keeps raining. I will probably order one online. Yeah, that's the plan for this midday activities. Um, so I wrote my to-do list on my phone and I've been using an app called Obsidian lately um, Which is kind of like Notion. It took me a while to get my head on it, but I absolutely love it now So I've got the sync uh, feature so I can make a to-do list on my phone 
on the, the app and then it will just automatically over Wi-Fi go onto my computer so I can see what I'm doing and I'm using a um a um what's it called like an extension um I forgot they called them on here where it's um got this thing called daily notes so each um day I'll have a new like, page set up for that day and then I've also got another plugin that's what they're called um that will take any of my tasks and put them onto the tomorrow if I don't get any of them done so it's pretty useful I would go through my to-do list in detail but it's mostly just really boring stuff like tidy up hoover download sd card footage do my car insurance which is not very exciting but um realistic week in my life so just gonna make a smoothie um a blender is something i wish i bought ages ago i only bought it when i moved house in august and it was only like i think someone was like 25 pounds from asda and it's a breville um, branded one so it's really good and it's got ice crushing power so we did quite a bit in there it's just like quite the Nutribullet ones that goes on top and I have ADHD so I sometimes forget to eat meals or just don't I also don't really like eating fruit on its own but a smoothie is just a really easy thing that I can make it's pretty low effort and I have protein powder um, some sort of seeds whatever I've got in and some oats just to make it a bit more filling and full of fibre and it just helps me get loads of nutrients that I wouldn't really want to eat on my own volition and it's, they taste so good so if you struggle to have time to you know make a full meal sometimes or just can't be bothered or want a snack but you don't really fancy just eating you know crap I really recommend smoothies uh, it doesn't take up much space at all and it's really good for my ADHD brain and having a high protein diet with fruit really helps me focus and have ADHD and I've just dropped fruit all over the floor. Um, yeah, just a, a tip. I don't know how, I'd like to make a full video at some point talking about um, having ADHD, how it affects me at uni. As I think my experience is quite different to some people, my experience getting diagnosed, I am medicated. Uh, I take slow release medicine and yeah if that's something people would be interested in and how I would you know, sort of hacks something a bit different you don't need to be ADHD to follow ADHD hacks I think they're just quite accessible for lots of people and yeah trying to do more talky bits to the camera and sort of what content like this it's probably enough fruit just to try and make it more interesting and see if I can impart any wisdom I don't have yeah that much fruit and then but what I started doing something a bit different I started doing this yesterday where in this I'll add um, a little bit of matcha powder I absolutely love matcha I do make it the proper way normally before anyone comes at me but it's just I really like it it gives me a bit of a caffeine boost I think that's not coffee because I'm trying to cut down on my coffee so I'm only trying to have one coffee a day which is quite low for me and yeah, if anyone's got any ideas and more random stuff I can add to my smoothies, do let me know. Let's finish. Do you have that which we takes five minutes to make? That's pretty good. <clears throat> just quick and easy. Not ready for lunch, but one snack. And if I don't drink it all, I can just chuck it in the fridge. Which is great. Um, now I'm going to do the first thing on my TOS, which is finish my research design draft. That which we had two references. I have to do that. I probably should have just finished last night, but I was tired. It's been a long day. Um. So yeah, I've sent finished my draft research design, and that didn't take too long to finish off. I don't know why I didn't do it last night. Now, and yeah, I'm pretty happy with it. There's some things I'm not sure about it. This one's just a draft to go over with my um, dissertation supervisor on Friday. And yeah, I think I'm excited to, you know, crack on. My literature review is coming along slowly. I've got a good idea of it. It's all just in bullet points, so it's not sort of anyone but mine. Uh, I don't really want anyone else looking over it quite yet. But I think I'm getting there. It's going all right. And... Yeah, I'll probably crack on more with that tomorrow. Can we do some house jobs today? Um, so one big thing already crossed off the to-do list. I um just uploaded a new YouTube video. 
uh, which is a little sort of mashup vlog of an afternoon I spent on my recent trip to Jersey, which was not so recent now, and I just haven't done the voiceover. So just sat, done the voiceover. It's all right. I'm trying to post regularly at the moment. So my new academic year's resolution um, is try and post once a week, twice a week at a push, um, depending on how busy I get. And I'm just trying to get out of the, it has to be perfect, the best thing, and people have to watch it. They don't. I don't really care. People probably aren't going to watch this. It's just more to get into the habit. And I just, I do just love sharing archaeology. And yeah, eventually I'll get better. <laughs> but I'm happy, I'm happy I've got that done. Um, you can go watch that video here. It's called Megalithic Monuments in Jersey. So good evening, um, my supervisor meeting was great, it's kind of just like a little catch up to see how we're ready for the year, the start of each semester, have it at the end of each semester as well, um, so that was all That was all great, talked about masters, um, what I'm thinking about doing for my masters, things like that. Then I got back and then me and my partner went to the, out shopping for a bit, I got some new shoes, we had a Wagamama's for tea and it's now a few minutes to seven, um, so we're going to watch um, I think I'm going to watch a comedy special and then it is time for the new season of Great British Bake Off and that'll be it for tonight. I don't have any uni timetable tomorrow but I've got lots of uni bits I want to get done and I will see you in the morning. morning it is wednesday today um had a bit of a lion and have been to the gym this morning did a leg day i haven't done a leg day in about two months and ow it's all i'm gonna say like that uh, i don't have anything timetable today so i'm gonna spend the rest of the day at home i think got some household chores that i need to get done like hoovering do a bit of mopping nothing too exciting and then i want to do some work on my dissertation which to review then i also hopefully might actually have time to play head and salt today and start the let's play series of that but yeah i'm gonna make a smoothie now um it's currently 11 20 so morning's almost over but no i definitely needed a slow wire bed this morning as i was shattered from monday and tuesday um early starts i'm definitely a morning person but I am not used to being up that early and that's about it for now. Cool, so I'm all showered now and I've put some comfy clothes on. I'm not getting into real clothes today unless I have to go out anywhere because I am tired and today's a rest day. I'm now going to um, prep some food for tonight. Um, I'm going to have some tofu nachos. I'm um, just so going to shred some tofu and marinate it now so it'll all be ready for this evening then I think I'm going to tidy up in here a bit more um, use the hoover and mop the downstairs I should do that for my bag season up and um, that didn't go the best I don't think I was using firm enough tofu and I'm not really used to cooking tofu. I haven't cooked it a bit much before. But I've got something. Hopefully it'll be edible. Um I'll find out later. So I've tidied and I set up my printer and I've printed off a load of papers that I have already read but I just find it so easier to read like physical ones. Um, that was a bit of a nightmare, the printer said stop working, um, I got angry at the printer. So yeah, I don't actually read anything but that's alright. Um, it is now 5 o'clock almost. Uh, I've seen a recipe for something I really want to try so I think I'm going to bake something and then make a start on tea.
morning. It is now Thursday. Um, those tacos were so good last night. Mm -hmm. I'm just thinking about them and it's now 8 a.m. the next day. Um, it really worked actually. I think I don't know how I was out on myself whatsoever. Um, yes, it is Thursday. Um, I've got a work dissertation workshop at 11, which is two hours long. And then that's all the time here for today. And I think I'm going to crack on with work, so not, not a very eventful day, hopefully. Uh, I ate so much from the gym and did not sleep very well. It's currently 8 a.m. So, yeah. Coffee time. I am absolutely drenched. The dissertation workshop was good though, uh, useful, clarified some things, uh, but the rain, the rain's insane. I am um, so it's my bone, I had to go buy an umbrella, I forgot to bring mine with me, and it just did not do very much at all. But yeah, I'm gonna have a snack, maybe prep some tea, I need to get changed out of my drenched clothes, uh, watch new Agatha Wong episode, and then probably just do some work, which, yeah, not, not too much going on. I made this last night and it's like a sweet bread cinnamon roll and it's really, really good. So. Um, so now I'm just making some notes on some paper. I put all the papers that I printed off into like a ring binder and I've also just put a notepad at the bottom and I'm just scribbling down some, basically like, I know what I want to do for my literature design, but I want to just put it all in one place for my literature review and just see what I've got and then start filling in the blanks and just trying to figure out where I'm up to. I feel a bit overwhelmed with the concept of it, which I think is perfectly normal. And it's just trying to, you know, get some thoughts on paper and just figure out what I'm actually doing. Because I know I know what I'm doing, but sometimes it just doesn't feel like you're doing your brain, you've just got too much in there. But it is starting to make sense. I think we're getting somewhere. I'm just going to work on that for a bit. So I've just um, done some reading and I'm actually making loads of great progress, but I need to stop and start making tea soon. And I just thought you'd find this funny. Um, the paper I'm currently reading is called Romans and Roller Coasters, and I think that's the sickest name for a paper ever. Stop honking. Sorry about that. Okay, so we're going to make some food now. Um, just like meal prep it. Uh, having a bit of a later tea today. And I'm honestly going to make the exact same thing that I made yesterday, but with just different seasoning. So yesterday I had the shredded um, tofu um, in some tacos, but today I'm going to do it in like a Greek seasoning and have it with some hummus and some wraps. As uh, so I just really seem to be in a wrap meal at the moment. I don't usually eat wraps this much, but yeah, that's what I'm going to do now. Good morning, it is finally Friday. Um, this week's actually gone pretty quick and it is not raining currently, finally. Um, it was raining all through the night, but that's good. Uh, today I've just got a meeting with my dissertation supervisor this morning, then I'm gonna work in town for a bit before meeting up with some friends to go to a new cafe that's just opened. So it should be a pretty good day. Um, probably end this vlog a bit later today, as I don't think I'll vlog on the weekends as I'll just be in work all weekend but yeah I've had a lot of fun doing this this week just gonna make my coffee and then speedily have some breakfast and get dressed because I need to sort of everywhere thing that's all we're going to stay in for longer but yeah it's been a good week let's get them
So today's been really good. Uh, my dissertation meeting went really well. Then I just worked in the um, common room for a bit and then I went out with my friends to get some coffee and a little sweet treat, which was amazing at a new local bakery called Hepney, which apparently means look in Old Norse, I think they said. It's really cool. Um, the river's really high. <laughs> I'm surprised it's not completely flooded and it is quite cold. So I've got the onesie out. It's a penguin onesie. Um, to keep myself warm. I've been chilling since I got in, been on for a while now. And my whiteboard has arrived, which is quite big. But I think that'll be really useful. It's just how my brain works. Um, it's better for me to visualise things and put it down. Uh, my girlfriend's currently making this tea, um, which will be really nice. I'm going to cook tonight. Um, she does cook most of the time, or quite a lot of the time as well. And yeah, so having definitely having Katsu Curry, which is always really nice. And I'm probably gonna end the vlog about here. So thank you so much for watching this week in my life. Um, it's been a great first week of third year. Um, I hope the rest of third year continues like this. Subscribe for more archaeology content. Um, not sure I'm gonna post it. I don't like to post some informative stuff. And make sure you check out some of my other videos if you haven't already. And yeah. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again in the future.